Welcome back to Space Weather News, your daily source for all things space weather related. If you enjoy our videos, please consider showing your support by subscribing to the channel. Recently, the Sun has released a powerful X2.2 class solar flare, which is expected to cause a geomagnetic storm on Earth. Experts are warning that this event is particularly concerning as the Sun is currently at its most volatile due to reaching its solar cycle peak. Solar Cycle 25 began in 2019 and is predicted to reach its peak in July of 2025. The sunspot eruption that produced the strong solar flare was recorded by NASA's Solar Dynamics Observatory STO, as an extreme ultraviolet pulse. Solar flares are sudden and brief bursts of intense energy from the sun's surface that release a significant amount of radiation across the electromagnetic spectrum, including X-rays and ultraviolet light. This energy burst is caused by the release of magnetic energy stored in the sun's atmosphere. This recent explosion is one of the most potent solar flares observed in recent times and signifies the increasing intensity of the sun as it approaches its peak. However, the danger is not yet over. These eruptions release a significant amount of coronal mass ejection CME, into space, which may potentially trigger a solar storm upon reaching Earth. The impacts of a solar storm could potentially harm satellites, disrupt mobile phone and internet networks, cause power grid failures, block radio communications, and much more. Experts are warning that a minor G1 to moderate G2 geomagnetic storm is possible this weekend in response to two incoming CMEs. In response to this powerful solar storm, the spaceweather.com report mentions that space weather expert Dr. Tamitha Scove took to her Twitter handle to inform, the earlier solar storm may have fizzled, but our sun gives us another chance for aurora. Predictions from NOAA and NASA estimate storm arrivals starting midday on February 19th to midday on February 20th, GMT. Let's hope the sun's aim is better than last time. Geomagnetic storms, a type of space weather, are much less frequent, but have the potential to cause damage across the globe with a single event. In the past, geomagnetic storms have disrupted space-based assets as well as terrestrial assets such as electric power transmission networks. According to the OECD, extra high voltage EHV, transformers and transmission lines, built to increase the reliability of electric power systems in cases of terrestrial hazards, are particularly vulnerable to geomagnetically induced currents GICs, caused by the disturbance of Earth's geomagnetic field. Thank you for watching our video on the recent solar flare and potential geomagnetic storm. Remember to stay informed and prepared for any potential impacts from the solar storm. We encourage you to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more updates on space weather and other fascinating scientific discoveries. Stay safe and stay curious.